Good morning. Welcome to Dr. Rajim Sal Central Agriculture University. I am Dr. R.C. Srivastava, Vice Chancellor of the University. This university was established as the SAU in 1970 and it was upgraded to Central India Agriculture University in 2016 by an Act of Parliament which said that its vision will be advancing professional competency for pursuing excellence in education, research and extension and mission will be to promote high quality learning environment including all the stakeholders and nurturing national and the global need of sustainable food production. The budget is provided by the DARE, Department of Agriculture, Research and Education under Ministry of Agriculture and Food, uh, Farmers Welfare of Government of India and in 2019-20 we got 262 crores at the budget. Uh, in last two uh, three years, we have taken initiative in the fields of uh, academia, research, extension and infrastructure. Under the academia, we started with the e-education, education, modern education technology, new academic programs and under this we have converted our 65 classrooms to smart classrooms and we have started an online education program for during the COVID period and we have got faculty induction program for our new faculty and framework agreement between university and the other organization both uh, abroad as well as the India. Under the research, we have started the Startup Facilitation Center for commercialization of the technology which we have developed. Our research program is mainly farmers and society centric and we are working mainly on the development of the technologies which are suitable for environment and suitable for the farmers. A special focus is on the solar energy. And then we, for this, we are also trying to uh, focus on different small problems, problems, specific problems. And for that, we have established center of excellence and advanced centers. We are using the digital platform for our technology dissemination in the second and we have taken the initiative to make our campus green in the for saving the water, energy, and the waste management. Uh, the outcome of this has been that we have been able to start 49 academic programs. Our student is increased from 478 to 1475, retention is increased to 95 percent, representation of from different states has increased to 27 states and last year we were ranked among the top 10 government universities by India today. Under the research, we have developed 11 new varieties of different crops. We have developed, validated and released 12 new technologies. Uh, as you know, Bihar is a flood prone region with a huge area being the waterlogged. We call it challenge ecosystem and we have developed the production technology for enhancing agriculture production from this area. And another focus which we have started is the wealth from waste in which we are we, we have developed technology for using maize crops, pigeon pea stocks like waste uh, to convert them economically suitable articles. By this, the farmer's income can increase by 10, 15 to 20 percent without any additional investment. We are using up uh, skill up upgradation for the of about the farmers. We have done it for the around one lakh thirty five thousand farmers and. A, a, we are going for need-based infrastructure addition to our whole system. During the COVID-19, our major focus was how to ensure that the academic system is not disrupted and I am happy to inform you that our technical academic session both 1920 and 2021 has not been disrupted. We completed it by our um, online efforts. We remain in contact with the students. Our faculty member worked day hard and thus we have been able to complete all the scheduled examinations, both midterm and end term, and we have completed the monsoon semester on 10th of January, just a delay of 10 days, not more than that. Our research program has continued as well. As our extension program, we have contributed our might to the training the migrant laborers, which was a major problem for Bihar, and we have given a technology basket 
for training the farmers and our administration the process is going on uh, as we, uh, we have used the technology for recruitment as well as the placement uh, we have also during this COVID-19, we had social responsibility, we performed, we distributed hermit bag for the storage of grains to the farmers so that they don't resort to the distress cell. We uh, distributed bal sakti and nutrition and nutrient supplement dollar by us to the slum dwellers as well as we distributed mask and touchless sanitizer dispenser and hand wash system to nearby temples as well as the civil hospital. In future plans, we are planning to uh, implement the new education policy 2020. We are one of few universities who have prepared the roadmap for it, and we are going to introduce uh, certificate courses uh, to meet the high demand of uh, trained manpower for low end jobs for industry and the service sector, which will also serve as one of the feeder channels for admission to the undergraduate courses. We are also going to start PG diploma courses for um, preparing the industry ready professionals. In research, our research and extension of our programs will continue. However, in extension, the uh, expertise which we have gained for the digital using the digital platforms for communication and learning we'll be using it in our kvk to have a quantum leap in the number of the farmers which we are going to serve in instrument apart from our really opening new colleges and uh, providing better infrastructure to our farmers our students and the faculty members will be emphasize putting up strength to our IT infrastructure so that our blended method of teaching both for the students as well as the farmers is strengthened. Thank you.